Hey everyone, welcome back. So it's been a little while since I've been on here to record a read aloud, but I am back. I wanted to dedicate this special book to my first grade friends. This is a book that we read at the beginning of the year together to talk about how all of us are friends and all of us are a family. And I just wanted to remind all of my first grade friends that I love them so, so, so much. And we are still a big family and I just really love and appreciate each and every one of them. So I just wanted to dedicate this book to them. It's called Our Class is a Family. I actually had all of my friends sign the inside of the book and I'm gonna keep this forever and ever and remember all of you. Um, but I just wanted you to know how special you are to me. This book is called Our Class is a Family. When you think of family, you might picture one in a house. A mom, a dad, a couple of kids, plus their dogs, and a pet mouse. Perhaps you think of grandma, a stepmom, or stepdad. It could be those 14 cousins or that twin that makes you mad. But family doesn't have to be who you're related to. It can be another special group that loves and cares for you. Have you ever thought about where most of your time is spent? It's at school with all of us. That's where all of those hours went. So if our classroom is the place where we spend most of our days, why wouldn't we want to make it like a home in many ways? It's a place where we can show respect and kindness to each other, a spot where we can be ourselves and make memories with one another. We have things in common. These are connections that we all seek, but we'll still celebrate our differences and what makes us all unique. Our classroom is a special haven where it's okay to make mistakes. We learn from them and try again, no matter what it takes. We all have tough days sometimes, but your teacher is here for you. As long as you're a friend to others, your peers will be there too. In this classroom of four walls, we will stick together. We'll help each other learn and grow in any kind of weather. So let's always remember what a great team we can be. You have our back and we have yours. We're a classroom family. Welcome, sweet classroom. So I love reading this book to all of you and all of my first grade friends because it just reminds us how we are all connected. Even though we aren't blood related and we don't live in the same house, we still share a classroom family. We still are really a big part of each other's lives and we really care about each other. And I think of all of you as my own kids because I don't have any kids of my own. And I'm still wearing our bracelets. All of my first grade friends on our first day of school when we read this story together, we made these friendship bracelets. They say first on it. Most of us have been wearing them every single day. And I just want all of you to know that even when I'm not at school, I wear this bracelet because I think of each one of you and how much you mean to me. And I just love you all so much. So thanks for reading this book with me and I'll see you next time. Bye.